take two. The first one, I opened up YouTube in Firefox and the sound skipping all the time. I'm now on Google Chrome. I said to Andrew, why is it easy to doubt Andrew? He says, oh my god. Nobody has more fucking problems than you. I said, well, tell me why on Firefox, if I own YouTube, it sounds skipping all the time. He says, well, use Google Chrome, which I am at the moment. But you he, he don't know why, through Firefox, YouTube sound is skipping all the time. Anyway, I've always liked the song, The Everly Brothers, Kathy's Clown. Your Kathy has got a clown, hasn't she? You. Thanks for making sweet Kathy use such disgraceful language. I bet she goes to church every Sunday, don't you? And probably says her prayers every night. You slob. Steve. Stephen. Stephen. Well, I mean, what do I call you? Stephen or Stephen? Or Steve? And, uh, I watched my DVD. Flowers of War, very violent film, with Christian Bale, and a largely Chinese and Japanese sporting cast, based on two events. And uh, Christian Bale, of course, he played Batman, didn't he? And at the premiere in America, that madman jumped up on stage and started firing bullets at the audience. And uh, afterwards, uh, Christian Bale, the actor, turned up at the hospital unannounced for a surprise uh, visit. He didn't tell the media because he didn't want to turn it into a media circus. He just wanted to visit some people in the audience who had been injured. But somebody got the mobile phone camera out and took a photo of them with that youth that had been injured. Yeah. Fine man, Christian Bale, the great actor, the fine humanitarian. Now I've got a problem. I'm returning that video to Love Film with Peterborough, and I've only got about six left in my list, and I've got to have at least 13. Well, see, I'm, the films, well, I, I know I've seen them hundreds of times before, but I'll add uh, The Damn Busters and Shane. Then, of course, there's uh, The Magnificent Obsession with Rock Hudson and Jane Seymour, a lovely film. But that was before Rock came out of the closet. <laughs> My ex used to think he was lovely. She drooled over him. And then it, it was announced that Rock Hudson was gay. She went right off him. She's a fucking pervert. I said, well, I thought you liked him. Well, I did, but I don't now. What women fickle. But I'm sure Kathy isn't. No. And I thought of another I can add to the list. Yeah, great idea. The famous old film Wuthering Heights with Florence Olivier and is it Olivia de Havilland? Now, the scene where Kathy's dying and Heathcliff holds her in his arms and the sawing music well there's me and Christine got our anchors out now you and Cathy could do a version of Wuthering Heights couldn't you Steve yeah with you out on the moors and Cathy shouting out the window Heathcliff Heathcliff where are you Heathcliff you shout I'm here, my darling. You say, don't forget me, fags. <laughs> Whose joke was that? Was it Jimmy Tarbuck? If you and uh, your Cathy did it, I mean, your Cathy could be shouting out the window, he's clear, he's clear. And you say, yes, my love. You say, don't get pissed tonight. <laughs> but I don't think Cathy used language like that, though, would she? Uh, isn't uh, eggnog insulting? In some of the comments he makes, a fine upstanding gentleman like him, his standards do drop at times, don't they? What did Gollum say? He thought he got uh, tinnitus, but it was my video. You bastard. How dare you.
How dare you insult King Arthur? I might be coming down to Cornwall again. I'll come around Shepton Mallet and sort you out on the way down or on the way back. Anyway, this uh, I've had to do a take to the say for, for what I said earlier, and the first one went on a bit because the time is now. Oh, okay, now one thirty-five. Well, be better to. I've unplugged the phones. There's Andrew, if not here. I don't want the hypochondriac to phone me. Oh, I've fallen out of bed. I mean, you lot might say, "Oh, get up there." Well, uh, I know I'm. I'm knocking on a bit, but I'm not into fucking old hags. No, I'm afraid to say. So I mean, me saying that uh, eggnog is insulting. Well, I suppose I could be just as insulting. Yeah, tight awful. Let me do the sign of the cross. Lord forgive me. Kathy, forgive me. So, uh, I think there's other things I mentioned, but I can't remember now. I've got to do it again because the sound was awful. Skipping like mad. I tell Andrew, it's all fucking old dad. Nobody has problems like you do. I says, well, I've already said this. I might have done on the first one. I said, well, you're supposed to be the expert. Tell me, why, if I open YouTube up while I'm on Mozilla Firefox, the fucking sound's no good. He says, I don't know. Use Google Chrome. So that's what I'm using at the moment. And the sound's not perfect, but it's not as bad as Mozilla Firefox. But I like to, I mean, I could have Facebook on Google Chrome, but... Uh, it's not got the add-ons that Mozilla's got. Yeah, anyway, I'm tired. Fuck it, I'm going to bed. Oh, that's where my daughter's going. My daughter and David, my son-in-law. They're, uh, 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 they're going to fuck it, my daughter says. Fouquet, or Fouquet, Dad. Somewhere, she said it's 81 degrees in the middle of the night. So Christ. And uh, I don't know where it is. Is it in the Arab Emirates? This place called Fuck It, Fouquet. I don't know. Right. So, yeah, I've been up to rub cream around my neck, around that area. Because uh, I don't know what it is, whether the soap powder I'm using is rather sore. I've been rubbing dermatitis cream in. And, uh, yeah, as well as I saw, I'll rub some more and get some more from the doctor. I said to see my doctor again. Hopefully, get to see the only English doctor, Dr. Bainham. Otherwise, it would be Dr. Amin, Dr. Kelly, Dr. Ahmed. And what is that other cunt? Uh, uh, I can't remember his name. He's a Sikh. This here with a turban on his head and all my notes in his hand because he's not computer literate. Why, Mr. Day, are you taking these tablets? I, said, well, I don't know, you're the doctor, you tell me. And then he dropped all my notes all over the floor. I thought, what kind of fucking idiot am I dealing with here? Hey? Oh, what's his name? I can't remember. Right, I'm off now, I'm going to bed. A very good morning, early morning. Probably get up about seven. Have a couple of boiled eggs. I've got to use some eggs up because a neighbour's going to bring me some extra large eggs. I've got to use these eggs up. I think I might have three boiled eggs. You know, with some soldiers. I do like boiled eggs. They're rich in protein, aren't they? And as I said earlier on my Facebook page, if you float an egg in a bowl of water, excuse me, been eating strawberries, they're repeating, <gasps> and if you boil, uh, put an uh, egg in a bowl of cold water, a bowl of water, and it sinks to the bottom, it, that means it's okay. It's a good egg. But if it floats on the water, it's not a good egg. You'd have to crack it open and the smell will knock you back. 
because can you remember we used to get stink bombs all them years ago? Me and the lads, I was only about before I went in the RAF and down in the centre of Nottingham one summer night, I think it was summer, we uh, about six of us went in there, you know, pub were packed and people were dancing and we all kept our eye on our watches and at a certain time we all dropped the stink bombs on the floor on Trollen, and then we all walked out and ran across the road back to the car back to the big Granada I had I think it was a Granada and we sat there laughing as all the windows went open <laughs> <laughs> all the windows went open and everybody rushed out the pub six stink bombs and you know the smell I think it's sulphur it smells like rotten eggs. Oh, that was great fun. <laughs> we thought it was wonderful, but you can't get them now, can you? Uh, picture, you know, in the lift. Drop one in the lift just as you walk out in a big store with the lift packed. <laughs> Everybody would be looking at each other. Who's fucking. <laughs> who's fucking dropped one? <laughs> or who's dropped the gun? <laughs> Say it. Who's dropped the guts? <laughs> Let me get to bed. Oh God. Good night. No, it's fucking morning now, isn't it? Good morning. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>